All right, let's continue on here. Let me just. Since I grew up in Canada, we didn't talk a lot about it when I was younger. But just, now that I've moved to the United States, I'm just States, waiting to get to the talking end. Talking about the California Gold Rush, I was really surprised. That, you know, now things are making sense. Now I know why you know they're called the California uh, 49ers and things like that because it's all connected to the California Gold Rush. I had no idea. I just kind of thought Disneyland was there. Okay, so that's the end of me talking. So I'm just gonna go, again, I don't wanna end right exactly when I stop. I wanna just give it a few millimeters here. And then I'm just going to split the clip. Okay, so there we got that part. Now we got probably our next question. Okay, so you see I kind of rambled on. Uh, that's me talking. Uh, best if you don't memorize your answers, you just try to have some ideas of what you wanna talk about. Okay, let's do the next one here. Uh, what problems did you encounter while working on this piece and how did you solve them? Okay, so we need to get that one in there. Uh, what problems did we solve? Let me just put that title down in here. Again, put the title between the clips, not on top of the clip, okay? And um, double click that. Futura Medium. Okay, what? What was it? What problems? I don't know what I say. Let me go back to, um, let's see, what problems did you encounter while working on the piece and how did you solve them? Boy, that's a lot of text there. Let's see if we can get that all on one screen. Problems did you encounter and how did you solve them? Question mark. Okay, we shortened it, but that's what we want there. Uh, again, press the little check mark up there that locks it in, and now let's go edit out. Me talking. Want to talk about? Okay, that's me rambling. Uh, I had a lot of. Problems. Okay, this is me saying I had a lot of problems. I can see where it starts here. Again, I come up a little bit in front of it, a few millimeters in front of it there, and I um, split the clip. Okay, so the clip that's highlighted now, all this, I know this is all garbage, so I'm just going to press backspace. And let's just double check our work. It goes from this guy, it goes from me talking. Yeah, I just kind of thought Disneyland was there. Uh, I had a lot of problems working with the clay for claymation. First of all, I would have sometimes like the little character. Okay, so that's me now talking about that. Are you understanding kind of how we're doing it here? Um, you, you put the the titles in here. Uh, the default is for four seconds. That normally is enough. If you needed to make it longer, you could just grab the, the right edge of it here. And when those double arrows appear, you could make it shorter or smaller or, or longer if you needed to. But four seconds to me is a nice time on there. Let's just see me talking, talking, talking. So, so it, it turns out claymation is a lot harder than it. Okay, so that's me still talking about claymation. So I had to go back and reshoot a lot of things. So I guess the Biggest way I solved problems was just to go and redo things. I thought I could finish it maybe just one try, but I think it took me four or five tries to get it right. But in the end, it worked out better. But that was my biggest uh, problem that I really kind of encountered on this project. Okay. So that's, that's me finishing talking. Give it a few millimeters and then put my playhead there and split the clip right there. Okay, now let's go on. We're going to add the other title between those two. Bring it down so it forces it in between and we go back would we say the next one was okay now let's say i didn't like that answer i could just record it again or if i flubbed up on here the next one i'm going to flub up on a sentence and we'll see how it did okay so let's do number four what was especially satisfying to you about either the process or the finished product? okay okay what was especially satisfying to you okay so double click on the title Change that to future or medium. What did I say it was? For what was especially satisfying about the project? Okay, I'm just going to shorten that question so it's a little easier. Was this Satis. I know I spelled it wrong, Satis. I about the Okay, so I got my little spelling mistakes fixed there, and let's just check that. Oh, I need a question mark in there, so double click it, get in there and edit, put a question mark in, 
check mark. Okay. Okay. Now, let's say I didn't like especially sensitive. Me... Okay, I love that when I... Okay, so I think I found out where I... I'm going to go just a few millimeters in front of it, and I'm going to split the clip. I know everything here on the left of that is garbage, so just delete that. So it goes right from the title. Okay, I love that when I have this chance for me to finally show the project, that everybody cheered. No, I don't think that makes sense. Let me start that one again. I love that when I finished the project, the teacher showed it to the whole class, and everybody kind of reacted how I thought they would. They, they laughed at the parts that were funny. Okay, so that's... I see I've got it twice there. So this is the one of me messing up. And then I love that when this is me saying the real one here. Right? This is the okay, I love this, I, this is the bad one. This is the good one. I love so I'm just gonna go a little bit in front of that. Um, clip that and then delete that one. So let me just check to make sure it goes from the title. I love that when I finished the project, the teacher showed it to the whole class and everybody kind of reacted how I thought they would. They, they laughed at the parts that were funny. They were really quiet during the serious parts. And it was really interesting to see how my claymation could be used to teach somebody about something. In this case, you know, about the California Gold Rush. So that was really kind of uh, very satisfying to me about how butterflies, oh, see? Okay, where are my butterflies? Uh, very satisfying. Where's the start of that sentence? In this case, you know, about the California Gold Rush. So that was really kind of, uh, this is me when I start to say that was very satisfying. So I know I got to put a cut here because this I messed up this scent. I think I messed it up twice. Satisfying to me about how butterflies. Oh, see, said there were butterflies. That's messed up. Let me just say the sentence again. That was very satisfying to me to see um, my fellow students kind of. Oh, see, I messed it up again. That's right again. That was really satisfying. Okay. I can see from the waveforms. Do you see why waveforms are so important? Because I can see this is me talking again. And I know I got it right that time. So I'm going to just go ahead and cut this and double check. But yeah, everything that's highlighted right now is the bad part. So I'm going to delete that. So now let's just see it go from me talking and now into the good sentence. You know, about California Gold Rush. That was really satisfying for me to see. Yep, there it worked out just great. Respond in such a positive way. And everybody's been like, hey. Really cool animation, and I, I really like that. So it was a really fun project. Okay, so that's the end of it. So I'm just going to go uh, just a few millimeters after I finish talking. I'm going to clip that. This time I need to delete everything to the right because I know that's all garbage. So go ahead and delete that. In the next video, we're going to clean everything up and make it look all pretty. And uh, I'll see you there.